Hey, within this video, I'm going to be directly revealing the truth, not the Genjutsu, about how sim heads and negative win percents have ruined NBA 2K, 2K24, future 2Ks to come, and they are completely funneling the machine, the system, okay? If you are in support of all this molasses, this slow down, this limited stamina, I'm going to be directly exposing you. But it's not your fault if you're ignorant, so just walk with me. Don't get offended. <laughs> don't get offended. Don't get offended. It's over. <laughs> but don't get offended. Walk with me. See what I have to say, okay? Pay close attention to what I'm saying and really think about it, bro. Now, before I get into anything, I have a 90 plus 1% in every 2K, been playing since the first 2K, done all type of <laughs> Facebook leagues, dominated all of them, been kicked out of more leagues than, than anyone in the history of anything. I've, I've done the whole playing out thing. I am immaculate. I know 2K more than anyone, even though I'm still a casual at the same time. I'm just very good with putting in not a lot of hours and I just understand it, bro. I want to show y'all something before we really get into the video called the learning pyramid, okay? You, if you listen to something, you can learn it 5%. If you read something, you can learn it 10%. Listen and read 20%. Y'all can apply this to anything in your life. I'm just letting you know why I am a master with this 2K knowledge and I just understand it more than anyone, okay? You demonstrate it. 30%, you discuss it, 50%, you apply it, 75%, you teach it, 90%, okay? So this clearly shows you gaps of who really understands what. You can apply this to anything in life. I just changed your life, okay? It goes more in depth, okay? This is, I'm just letting you know why I speak the way I speak and why certain things should be the way they should. And you know, I've, I've, I'm, <laughs> I'm body bagging, <laughs> I'm body bagging dog. Now, before we go into the main point of this video, y'all make sure y'all subscribe if y'all are new, help me hit 281k.5. We are like 30 subscribers away. Make sure you hit that goddamn like button. Help me get 150 likes within the first hour so the Vic can get pushed to the algorithm. Okay, help young Swan grow. Now look. If you are in direct support into the nerf of movement, dribble moves, stamina, you are fueling the machine and you are ruining the game. You are against, you are directly against the true 2K head. You are directly against yourself. This is why I say a lot of people ask for stuff and they don't know the consequences. They don't know what's on the other side of that door. And I'm going to break it down to you what's on the other side of that door. Now, with all these damn stamina restrictions, with this being the slowest 2K ever to exist, okay? This I'm a 91% guy. I'm not struggling. I'm just letting you know how the game is horrible, and I'm going to break it down, okay? Since the game's so slow... And a lot of y'all aren't guards. You're not main ball handlers, so you don't really know, right? But if you ever wanted to be the guy that we all want to be, the one we, you know, our favorite player is most likely a main ball handler. He's not no center or lock. But if you ever wanted to evolve and really play the game, this is what you're going to have to go through, okay? Once you play this hoe and really see what's going on, you're going to be like, damn, I'm slow as hell. Damn, if I do try to get wiggly... Ah, uh, my shot might kind of mess up. Damn, I need my stamina. That's so important, right? I'm not really moving fast. So what am I going to do to maximize my chances, especially knowing that my opponent is going to do that? Let me show you. Let me show you. This is what y'all are. <laughs> 2K is completely using the negative win percents. Envy to do this to do this right here. 2K14, you didn't have to buy Gatorade. 15, you didn't have to buy Gatorade. You move fast enough where you didn't feel like you really needed that. Do y'all get it? 2K16, you didn't need to buy Gatorade. 17, 
You need to buy Gatorade. Eight. And what 2K was that? The slowest one. They done used y'all niggas. They done used y'all niggas to do this. They done used y'all to do this. And they know y'all are so dumb, right? The builds went up, y'all sitting here accepting it, right? <laughs> Everything's related to the stamina, the Gatorade. To be able to shoot consistent, you gotta buy the Gatorade. If you, look, look, look. If you don't have the knowledge to know what you really need, right? If you're gonna play on a certain level, if you take, if you're trying to be somewhat competitive, you know, just like everyone should have, look, to have the most fun on the game is to just be a complete casual, live in nothingness. But if you wanna play, you know, you wanna be a little competitive, bro, bro, imagine just knowing that people have a higher advantage. It's, it, it helps you out, bro. Look, listen, listen, listen. For the people who say you don't need it, imagine you versus you right imagine swante versus swante one swante's jump shot boosted and ball handling boosted because you know that helps you too and he's triple gatorade boosted versus the swante that isn't that guy clearly has an advantage and since there's such a there's so much hate for the main ball handler that has been carrying your damn team for years. Y'all y'all really done turn your back on him. Y'all are making him not only waste his time by grinding his builds, paying for his builds, he now has to pay to play. Let's do some math, okay? He now has to pay to play the main ball handler. That's not crazy? So all three together is 10,500 VC, okay? Now let's add the skill boost, right? 1500, so 13K, 0.5. That's how much VC it is for all that at once for one game. Let's do the real money math. So you are almost paying, okay? You are almost paying $5 per game. And then, Y'all want to hate and make fun of the vets, right? Not only do all they moves get patched, removed, but now they have to pay to play. And then y'all, y'all be trying to make fun of and all this and that. And like, you know, praying on their downfall, but they got to pay to play this hoe, right? But if this game moved faster, if it played better, if everything wasn't so nerfed, would they feel the need to do this? This is why 2K is ruined forever. Because they can always use that damn bot to fight against the ones that are enlightened. And then the ones that are really low key, the enlightened ones, but they're at the bottom, they turn on their own kind because of envy and jealousy and being in the shadows for so long, then they, they finally come out the shadows and they turn on their own kind. It's just like in real life, the, you, you see the same thing. They turn when it's their turn. A lot of hate, a lot of resentment, dog. but what are you really doing? You feel me? For any main ball handler, he eventually gets to this point when he becomes enlightened. Do you wanna really play at a disadvantage all the time? No. You wanna have fun. We love basketball. We wanna, we clearly like some aspects about the game, but it's like, bro, this is so predatory, right? It's so predatory. And let me explain to you why the game is horrible even more in depth before any of y'all say something stupid, right? Before you say something stupid, right? In the comp scene, you can go to the stage. You can be a bottom of the barrel stage player, right? Or a comp park player, or maybe a mid-tier park player. And you can go compete with the best people in the game, in the stage, 3v3, and your main PG can have no speed with ball. He can have. Hold on. Let me. Let me. Let me. Let me. Let me show you. Let me show you. Let me. Let me. Let me. Let me show you guys. Y'all just don't understand, bro. Y'all just don't understand, bro. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Hold on. Hold on. Look, guys. <laughs> Y'all don't understand. You could make a six eight, man. It don't even matter, bro. Like, <laughs> you could do this. Look, 
you can you can really with this ball handling right here this is how the game listen when you slow down the game and you make ball handlers not that to where they can create separation from super big players this is what you create you make it to on the competitive level that people can run three center centers and dominate the game okay you can go to the stage and just drop step everyone right and since it's so and, and since you can't stand out enough to create a difference for someone who's post scoring which is so unstoppable and takes no skill you can just sit there and drop step the lockdown or the center and you will be more effective than the guard that's isoing that is in that is so in deep or the guard that's using the screen you will be more effective dog than them that's how you know the game is horrible bro do you feel me who 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 in real life is sitting there isoing going down and just post scoring and just drop stepping everyone on the damn court you don't see that in real hoops how is that real this is what i mean bro in any 2k to where they can run three centers and do that damn post scoring i don't care what you hear about post scoring bro shut your mouth you are an npc okay you are an npc stop speaking everyone knows post scoring takes no skill okay it is the easiest thing to do with the least talent period you got the easiest jump shots period you could dominate on any competitive level period and it's 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 exploitive it is cheese it's it's, it's it is a it is a much more impactful cheese that requires less time and skill okay a post score cannot go learn and master the left right and be effective but that left rider can master the post scoring do you see a lot of the sim heads are really cheesers guys they're really cheesers they want the cheese to take no skill so they can have a chance versus people they'll never even play but basically to wrap it up if you are in support of the game being this slow you're ruining the game and you just don't know it because you won't go play the game uh, there's too many people who have voices that won't go play the game if you hide in the wreck guys you live a fake reality that is you're playing the worst people in the game if you play play now you're playing the worst people in the game so you don't understand it's not to hate on you play where you want to play but please stop being so disrespectful to people that's in the field really playing the game you don't know what's really happening so again if you are in support of slow down molasses main ball handler movement instead of just buffing defense you are directly ruining the the whole game by making all main ball handlers pay to play the damn game and the reason is because there's so much pressure dog everything's against you the main ball handler is the only player that has to really adapt in every 2k okay lock mindless center mindless you don't the 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 main ball handler has to evolve his game and adapt right he has to pay to play because he gotta he's moving so slow when and then when he loses his stamina dog his shots off right because he's moving and stuff right and 2k's preying on that now imagine a 2k where you didn't feel like you needed to buy Gatorade. Imagine a 2K where Gatorade didn't exist. Imagine a 2K where you felt fast enough that you didn't, you feel me? So people's lack of skill. See, look, me, me for instance, I'm not, I don't look at stuff through envy, right? Let, let me tell you how pure I am in these 2K world, okay? <laughs> Dribble gods. 
I'm not a dribble head. I'm not a dribble god, bro. Okay? But I have no beef with them. So people cry about them and ruin the game, right? But they don't exist number-wise. They, they, who do you see spinning around? They don't exist. So let them have their fun. You feel me? And they're not exploitive. Like they're, they're not just ruining the game. Let them have their fun, you see? And they're great for the game. They pull great numbers. Look, Steezo, G-Man, Hank the Tank, the I Run You, right? Good for the game. All you have to do is learn how to play defense and dribble gods are done. You see, I don't have envy to a dribble god. Press that square button, he wanna get too freaky. I don't have envy to a dribble god. When I see him going crazy, I laugh. I'm like, that says, you know? <laughs> I'll be like, God damn, like I'm laughing. But y'all, y'all get mad. Well, not y'all, people. It's not it, bro. Uh, y'all need to get on the game to have fun. Like now comp player, for instance, how they play, they have to play that way because of who the comp level they're playing first, okay? Like really, really think about it. Why should their cries be heard when they barely verse that? If you're sitting in play now, you're never playing that, dog. If you're in the wreck, you're playing that one out of 10 games. Bro, you're not playing. Maybe one out of 12 games in the wreck. And, it, and I'm talking about it being effective. It might be way more than one out of 12 games, right? Just because someone know how to do something don't mean he effective with it. Stop. Bro, you could run a zone. You could pinch on him. You got to be a certain level to really. And that's such a rare player. So should the whole game be ruined and then make the main ball handlers pay to play just to hear for those cries? What? Is that not crazy? <laughs> and then in the park, you'll run into it every one out of 10 games. Most people are horrible. A lot of y'all think like there's way more comp people than there is. There's not. And then in the stage, everyone there is doing it. But that's the stage. That's, you know, we already know that's all the... You know, they're they're sweaty, they're they're deep in, they're gonna go meta mode. But but my thing is the negative one percent casual is gonna buy this hoe no matter what, and they're always going to feel the same. Do you not understand? The envious negative like he's always like for instance, say you patch left right, right? Now you could just left right with the goddamn magic Johnson, or you could still left right, right? They're still gonna complain about it no matter what. And they're still gonna stay in their modes. So what is the point in ruining the whole game? When you hear casual speak about the game, they think 2K is literally just roster updates and that the gameplay never changes. You feel me? Of course not the overall, like, okay, like paint defense always try, da, 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 da. like overall, it don't be changing. But the intricacies, they have no idea about. You feel me? They have no idea about. They don't be knowing stuff exists. Like, they think, they don't know, you could spin around in 18 and in every other 2K, you could still left, right in every damn 2K. You could still dribble in every 2K. Now, a lot of the creators that built this community and made this game lit, there are a lot of people in the background that did not like them, that did not like or respect them at all. They don't really care about the community at all. They want this community. To die i would never say 2k is dead there's always gonna be millions because of basketball and this being the only basketball game and then the whole experience of going it's always going to have a base it's always but i'm talking about the content community right because people don't like to watch this gameplay period <laughs> they don't it's not no old oh, da 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 Bro, if, if someone's turning on a stream and the gameplay is appealing, they're going to pull a certain amount of views. And now I'm going to tell you about another agenda of why this type of gameplay is being pushed. There's been a lot of people at the bottom looking at the creators at the top, feeling that they were undeserving, you know, uh, wanting to replace them, wishing they could replace them, not being able to do the things that they could do. So them always feeling like, man, I'll never be able to 
garner an audience like that, right? Now look, it's clear that the majority of NBA fans and 2K fans don't enjoy the gameplay. If they did, they would watch it more. It's not no da da da. I don't know any game that's doing better than ever and it doesn't show. Like in the content numbers. I'm not talking about myself. I'm talking about overall in the community. YouTube, Tiki, Instagram, YouTube Shorts. It's obvious, bro. It's obvious. The price point already crazy up there. But the the numbers, they're doing better than ever, right? But why doesn't it show that? And the numbers we can see, the ones that aren't hidden and given to us, the ones we can see, what's going on? Come on, guys. Come on, you can't be that stupid. They just posted a goddamn, hold on, let me show you something. Look at this, Spotify posted this. Spotify plans to charge for streaming fraud. Billboard reports the platform will financially penalize labels or distributors when it finds out that more than 90% of the streams on a song are fraudulent. Listen, more than 90%, that's insane. Guys, listen to me, listen to me. These numbers, it's all again Jutsu, bro. So when they use that argument that people are liking it more, look at the numbers more every year, guys, there are, bro, if, if you are a billion dollar company, of course you're going to be, so you, you can't use that argument saying that people like this gameplay more because it's not true. I'm in the game chat. I'm looking at the comments of stuff. It's just not true, bro. It's not true. You can see the numbers, bro. I seen I'm Davis, he got a 2K vid with 20K. Bro, no, if he dropping like on 19, like bro, it's not looking like that. They not the game, viewers aren't the game. Any game where the price point's that high, it's not targeted to kid, they're targeting 35 year old men that are envious of, you don't think that game is just up. <laughs> what? Bro, how is a game not for kids, bro? Do y'all not find that crazy? The AI is insane. <laughs> how many years we had to complain for them to finally put rookie? Bro, this incompetent. No. 2K, you gotta pay. I'm gonna get you. People enjoyed the, the past gameplay more where not everyone could be like everyone else. And now it's like in these slower games and all this and that, more people are like each other because they're stringing on to those some moves that give you that little bit of speed. In other games, you could have that speed with way more moves. You feel me? And it's, it's, it's just poor design and it's too, guys. So I told you the comp scene is shambles. The game plays in shambles. The people who defend the game, they won't turn on a stream and prove that they're having fun, right? So that basically just means everything they're saying is out of envy just because they've always hated certain type of creators and players, right? So nothing they say is valid anymore. Anywho, man, y'all click on the video on the screen if you want to see my new 6-8 build, man. But hey, hey, here we go again. Yeah. Here we go again. People talking this, but when this hit the fan, everything I'm at made me. Now break it down. Yo, off the top of the dome, dome.